Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Guys, in today's video, I need to share with you this one layering combination that has me all up in my feelings. Y'all, when I tell you, I don't really like patting myself on the back because I feel like the majority, if not all of my layering combinations are fire. I seem to have a gift of layering. <laughs> but this one right here, y'all, like, I don't know if it's because it's that dope or because these two scents just work so well together. Y'all, the combination is freaking insane, okay? So if you wanna know the layering combination that is like my best, one of my best ones this whole entire year, <laughs> like I'm not even exaggerating, then please continue to watch. Guys, before we get started with the video, please make sure you like this video, thumbs it up so YouTube knows you love my content, leave me a comment down below so we can get to know each other, and make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Now y'all, if you're no stranger here, you know every so often, every season, or every, you know, now and again, I'll do some layering combinations because... Like I said, I seem to have a gift of layering. It's so much fun for me. And the crazy thing is, back in the day, like I wanna say 2019, 2020, I was not the layering person. Like other than layering with body creams, you know, a scented body cream or whatever, that's the extent, that was the extent of my layering. But as my collection has grown, right? As you can see, the collection is collecting <laughs> and I like wearing my fragrances. Like every one of my fragrances in my collection gets touched, okay? So layering helps me go through my fragrances faster. <laughs> Not that I'm really like trying to run through the fragrances like a marathon, but we all know they have an expiration date and it just helps me to, you know, create new combinations, make my scents that would typically smell, you know, uh, familiar smell less familiar because i'm layering it with other scents and things of that nature so it's just so much fun for me i get to know my notes better and which notes go better with other notes i feel like that helps me in creating fragrances as well so the whole layering thing y'all like it's like a whole movement for me right now and this combination like it needed its own video i've came up with so many combinations here on my channel layering with vanilla 28 or ambrosia imperial blanche bet you guys know if you watch my layering videos i have a whole layering playlist the combinations be combinating okay like <laughs> I come up with some good combinations, but y'all, I don't know what it is about this one right here that just, when I tell you everywhere I went, I was getting complimented, okay? Bay was like, you know, like sometimes he gives me like a dry compliment. When I say a dry compliment, he'll be like, oh, you smell good. What are you wearing? You know, what is that? But when he goes in like, damn, bae, you smell mad good or whatever, like I already know, like, I done hit the nail on the head and he doesn't do that all the time. He always thinks I smell good. Like, let's not get it twisted because I always smell good. But I'm not always getting that compliment. So when I get that compliment, I already know. So I wanna share it with y'all, I'm not gonna get keep. So in the shower, I used, I think it was a Dove. I did this twice. The last time I used my Dove, um, it's like an antibacterial scrub and body wash. I just did that. I didn't use another scrub after and kept pushing. That's what it was. And then I came out the shower and I used this. This is newer to my collection. I want to say I saw Jackie Ina talk about this on her Instagram reel. And um, I saw it in the supermarket and I was like, oh, let me get this. Like, it's a small bottle. Let me get it, whatever. Now, this is really thick. It has a really nice consistency and the scent is really nice as well. I don't know what it smells like though. Like, I can't really describe the scent, but it's a really pretty scent, y'all. Yeah, it's really pretty. It's almost like, is it like a floral coconutty? But then it smells like ambery and vanilla. I can't describe it. But it smells really good. It's not a scent that you're gonna necessarily layer with something else to bring the scent out of because it just smells good. It can go with any one of your fragrances, but I love the consistency. Let me show it to y'all. It comes out, like it's not a spray, it comes out in this pump and you, you know, you squirt it out and it's like a nice thick consistency. You see that it's not too runny. It's nice and thick. It's nice and hydrating, nice and moisturizing. I love it. I mean, it's an oil. I'll link it. You can't go wrong. Now, 
after the oil, then I went in with my Triple Butter Royal Sandalwood Body Cream by Skin Potions. Skin Potion. <laughs> There's no S. Y'all, it's amazing. It's a creamy sandalwood, okay? If you love creamy sandalwood scents, you will absolutely love this. Honestly, let me tell y'all. So when Ray sent me my package, the very first time he ever sent me a package, I didn't know about Skin Potion. I didn't know about Ray. He sent me Royal Sandalwood and Kama Sutra. Now, I didn't know what Kama Sutra was, you know, so I didn't open that one just yet because I'm like, I don't know what the notes are. Like, I don't know what it is, um, but I know what sandalwood is and I love the way sandalwood smells. So this was the first one that I opened and this was the one that got my heart the first time. Like, it was my first obsession with skin potions because the sandalwood is just so amazing. Like, it smells so creamy. It smells so realistic. Like, it is kind of crazy how... It smells, and it also smells a little powdery. It's creamy. It's a little nutty. It is amazing. If you love sandalwood scents and you need something a little bit woody to go with your sandalwood or woody fragrances in the fall, winter, please pick this up. You will not regret it. You don't hear a lot of people talking about it, but when I tell you it was my first love from Skin Potion, okay? So I went in with the oil and then this. And honestly, this is so hydrating and moisturizing. Let me show y'all. You don't actually need to go in with an oil with this, but I mean, it's just my routine. It's just, you know, I shower with multiple body washes most of the time. And, you know, I have my gloves and my um, my mesh rag. I uh, scrub sometimes. I just have a routine. And when I get out, I'm putting on a body oil and then a body cream. So although you don't need a body oil with this, it's just something that I do. It's just what I do. I just love it. So look at this. Do you see how it just melts into your skin? It's so soft and smooth. I love the consistency and the texture of this. It is beautiful, okay? So Vaseline Radiant Body Oil with the Royal Sandalwood Body Cream by Skin Potion. Now, if you don't have the Royal Sandalwood, or if it's not in stock, the other alternative that you're gonna get a really nice sandalwood scent is by Nest, and this is the South Pacific Sandalwood. So it smells just like a beautiful sandalwood um, scent. <laughs> That's what it is, it smells like sandalwood. It's a little less sweet than the Skin Potion. I will say that the Royal Sandalwood by Skin Potion is creamy, it's sweet. For me, I catch like a little nuttiness in the background. I'm not sure if nuts are in there, but that's what I'm getting from it. This one smells more like a sharp green sandalwood, but it still smells good. So if you can't get your hands on the Royal Sandalwood, you can always get this. I'm gonna link everything below. Now, with this oil, you can layer it in your unscented cream. So if you have a body cream or a eucerin or any unscented body cream, you're just going to put it in your hand. And then you're going to take like a drop of this or a couple of drops of this, drop it in your hand. And then you have your own like sandalwood body cream. You know what I mean? You can use it as a lotion. You can use it as a fragrance because it is perfume, but I just like using it as like a body oil <laughs> or making, you know, my own body cream or whatever. So this is a great option. Like I said, if you can't get to the Royal Sandalwood now for the fragrance y'all. Okay. So the first thing I went down with is Valaya by Parfum Zomarly. Y'all know this was love at first sniff. Okay, like no hesitations, love at first sniff, okay? This fragrance is beautiful. You guys know I love almost everything Parfums of Marley comes out with from the men's line to the women's line. It's always like an instant love for me. There's only one Parfums of Marley fragrance in the gold bottle and the bottle is so freaking beautiful. But that one is like, eesh, I'm not really too sure about that one. I think the patchouli in that fragrance is patchouliing a little bit too much. But y'all, let me tell y'all Valaya. So in Valaya, we have aldehydes, white peach, bergamot, mandarin orange, orange blossom, lily of the valley, vetiver, ambroxan, akigala wood, and vanilla. Now, this is one of the fragrances that I wouldn't particularly put in a fall fragrance must-have video. Like, 
because it's not typically like your typical false scent, like your almonds and your caramels and your gourmands. It's not really like a false scent like that, but trust and believe this is a false scent for me because on days that I just want to smell like kind of pottery, kind of sexy, sweet, fruity, bright, not too deep and woody or not too gourmand or whatever this is a fragrance like this fragrance lasts forever on my skin i know a lot of you guys don't like valaya and i don't know what to tell you because this is a gorgeous scent it is so pretty so honestly this layered with like a sandalwood cream it's gonna give you your whole life all right like it's just a beautiful scent but y'all i don't know if i had a dream about this I don't know if it was a premonition, like deja vu. Something told me after I wore the Valaya, right? I picked up the Valaya. I did the sandalwood, sprayed the Valaya, and that was going to be it. Like I was planning on just doing this, but something told me I'm standing by my wall here and I'm just like, Valaya is beautiful. Like she could be worn on her own, but I was like, what can I add to her? What can I give a little razzle dazzle? And y'all, my eyes went straight to my initial section and I went straight to initial rehab. <sighs> y'all, let me tell you, these two fragrances right here, like if you have the two, I need you. I'm begging you. I'm asking you, please. I'm giving you homework. Please try this and let me know. I need to know if it's just me and everybody else that was smelling me that feels like it's amazing. Trust me when I tell you. So in Initio's rehab, we have lavender, bergamot, cedar, vetiver, patchouli, sandalwood, musk, and guyac wood. The notes are a little bit similar. This is like a creamy, sandalwood, woody, musky kind of scent. And you're kind of getting the same kind of vibe with Valaya, except it has fruits. It's more fruity and floral. So it's like a fruity, floral, woody, musky scent. And with this one, you're definitely getting like heavy on the woods, heavy on the musky. It's even bright because it has like that bergamot citrus in it as well. Y'all, just trust me when I tell you that you need this combination in your life. If you didn't know you needed it, all right? Like I'm telling you, you probably didn't know you needed it, but I'm telling you right now, you need this combo. It is everything guys it is so beautiful it lasted so long on my skin from the morning when i left the house until the night and i did this twice i have to do it one more time three strikes like three times a charm right i need to do it one more time because it's just that good everywhere i went i was getting complimented and i tell you bae was like yes like what you got on like i love that like when he gets excited about how i smell i already know and honestly before i left the room and I sprayed this and then I sprayed this on top. I was like, OMG, like this, like there's times that I layer and I, you know, put things together and I'm like, oh, I smell good. Like, yes, it smells amazing. But then there's other times when I do it and I'm like, wait a minute now, like, let me get my neck back because I just snatched it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's so good, y'all. So if you have the two, please try it and let me know. I'm so curious to know what you think. So this is it, y'all. Like the video is over like i have nothing else but i just had to come on here really quickly because this combo is everything you will be seeing it in a layering video coming up but i just had to give it a little bit more shine because it's just that dope y'all so let's talk about it below like we always do remember to stay safe be great stay great and always strive for greatness ai the great signing out but i'll see you in my next video peace